this is a highly requested video asking me to show my Cartier jewelry collection. At first, I didn't want to do it because I only have a few pieces in my collection. I wish I have more, <laughs> but I have just started, you know, not, not long ago. <music> detail on my pieces because I've already have a review of a couple of these pieces and I will link them below. I'm really happy with the collection I've built in the past one year and a half. All really strong, classic and stunning pieces. They are symbols of accomplishments and just milestones in my life. But before I show them to you one by one, if you are new to my channel, my name is MC. I'm into luxury fashion and lifestyle so if you like this kind of stuff and you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe don't forget to turn that notification bell on so you won't miss out all the videos i upload all right so let's start with the first piece i've purchased which was the view and clue ring by the way <laughs> excuse my nails one broke so i didn't have the choice but to trim them all and i didn't uh, apply polish anymore because i want them to rest as well so this is in rose or pink gold it's in the regular size or thick version plain as you can see i really love this ring because in my opinion if you want to get one only one ring from cartier I would recommend this piece. You don't have to worry too much about scratches. It doesn't have to be stuck because it does look nice on its own. I think the design is unique and edgy. You just need to be really careful with sizing though. It is important that you try it on at the store. The reason being is this part here, this one, that digs into your skin. If you don't size up or it's going to be very uncomfortable and irritating. Other than that, I think this ring is a statement piece, especially the one with diamonds. I use this often and I just love the way it looks. It doesn't have like visible scratches, which I love. And I highly recommend this to those who are starting to build their Cartier collection. So the next piece I purchased was this Jean Clou bracelet. It's a birthday present for myself early this year. I actually bought two pieces from Cartier at the same time, which I'm going to show uh, next. Anyway, this is such a beautiful uh, piece. I simply love its modern and daring design. I pick it in rose gold to match the ring. The design of this bracelet is very durable, making it perfect for everyday wear. The thickness makes it practically unbreakable. I also can't see scratches on it. I don't know. Maybe my eyes are just very low. <laughs> Personally, I like it plain without diamonds. Regardless of the seemingly minimalist design, the bracelet is a statement piece in its own. There's no need to stack it with other bracelets and no need to dress up for it. I think it works nice with just a pink t-shirt and jeans. Next is the love ring, which I bought together with the Gio and Clue uh, bracelet earlier. It was also a birthday present from me to me. <laughs> I love the little screw head motifs that decorate the ring. I thought that it looks elegant and refined, not flashy but you can immediately identify it as a Cartier piece. I wear this almost every day. As you can see that it's full of scratches already. I still love it. I love the sheen, the look, since this is in the thick version, I believe it's best to wear it alone. So if you want to stock it with other rings 
then you can choose the wedding band or tin version. My tip if you're thinking about buying the love ring, uh, figure out where you want the ring to sit in. The sizing is quite precise and since I wanted to wear the ring either on middle or index finger, I had to size up. So next is this love necklace 18 karat yellow gold set with 3 billion cut diamonds totaling 0 0.07 carats i just love the clean cut look of this it's not just tailored for men or women it is so shiny including the chain love is engraved at the back there diamonds are set in between the screw details yes it has some scratches as well but very minimal I use this uh, every day since I bought it and I got so many compliments whenever I'm seen wearing this really really love it so the last but not the least jewelry in my collection Cartier is this uh, love bracelet it's plain in 18 karat yellow gold in the thick version you can see that it has already scratches but very very minimal it's very shiny I really love this I haven't taken this out since I bought it um, it has been two months more than I believe so the size is um, 19 and it's best to use alone for me in my opinion because you know if you stuck it with other bracelets um, you can get it scratch so I hope to have more in my collection probably probably a pave <laughs> hopefully <laughs> but I don't know so that's it so what are some of your favorite pieces from Cartier let me know in the comments down below thank you so much for watching and if you've enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up I'll see you on my next one bye